What's goody with y'all, man? What's goody? What's goody? What's goody? Yo, this is Reek the Fleek. And this is Leaky Leak. And this is Reef Fleek. Anime Horror Gang. What's good with y'all, man? Got another video. Today we're going to be reacting to Sensei. Yo, man, shout out to Sensei, man. Yo, Sensei's the GOAT, man. We can't wait to check out this other video from him, man. Please subscribe to Sensei, y'all. So please like, comment, subscribe, and join our big happy family. Yes, y'all. Join the family, man. Anime Horror Gang, man. Once you join the family, you're Supreme Kai. You're a loser just like us, y'all. Please join the family because mm -hmm. we love entertaining y'all. We want to bring y'all more fire content. Mm -hmm. We ain't going to stop being a family. You know what I'm saying? Even though we small right now, we want to get bigger and have a big community of everybody being mm -hmm. just like us, man. So please join the family, man. Mm -hmm. We love entertaining y'all, making y'all day better. So please sit back, relax, and relax. Let's be yeah. All right, said so you got your stuff. All right, turn the lights off. <laughs> I'm about to tell you a very scary story. Hey, all right, what kind of story are you about to tell me? All right, listen, listen, listen. Oh, time. I was on a date. I'm not going front, y'all. Like me and Leaky Leak. Mm -hmm. When we was going to school, me and Leaky Leak really used to dress like the guy on the right, like all the time going yeah. to school. Dude, going to school dressing, I thought it was fly. It was our preppy Same swag. Way. It was preppy and nerdy swag to me. Mm -hmm. Bro, people was eating us alive with these. I'm like, dude, y'all so used to wearing true religion, Levi's, Jordans, and stuff. Bro, me and Leaky Leak came with some button ups. We didn't go to the same high school, but we dressed like we knew how we dressed like going to high school. Mm -hmm. So we had the um the um bow tie, we had the button ups, we had the khakis with the with the um moccasins on and stuff. Mm -hmm. Bro, we was killing it, bro. And we had the fresh cut. Yeah. Yo, people was hating so hard. And I'm looking mm -hmm. like, dude, let us be us. Like we don't want to rock Jordans and stuff like y'all. We want to be preppy and be Wearing stuff different. Please love y'all selves for who y'all are because I was still dressed like this mm -hmm. today. I was stro yeah, I was still dressed bad like this. Like, there is really nothing wrong with dressing preppy though. It really ain't. Like you be seeing mad crispy people dressing preppy. Mm -hmm. Like um Pharrell. Mm -hmm. Pharrell be dressing crispy when he preppy. And Tyler the Creator. I love when he dressed like it. Like mm -hmm. it's preppy nerdy swag to me. That's how mm -hmm. I feel like. Like I love yeah. that. Like I love it. Scary about that. Listen, listen. And when me and the girl got to the restaurant, Why she like had that? a bad wig. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my god, Nick. Jesus Christ. Oh my god, a bad wig, Nick. That's terrible. I almost had a fucking heart attack. <laughs> oh god. What happened after that? So we ate, right? Everything was good. And at the end of the meal, I asked her, Are you giving up that coochie tonight? Yo, so bro. Said, no. Oh my god. Because she said no. What happened after that? So then I tried to split the bill and she said she didn't have it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, yo, this bitch had a bad wig and she was broke. Jesus Christ. I, 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 that is so terrible. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. more stories, bro. This is goddamn terrible. I, I can't even believe that happened to you. What happened when you got home? Did I mean, did you did you date her again? That's the worst thing, said. After we left, she told me that I, I could come back to her house because she wanted to tell me something. And so I'm thinking, you know, maybe I was going to get some Gucci. <laughs> get to her house. I said, you hold on to your chair. This is, this, this is the worst part of the story. What happened? What happened? She had kids. Oh, my uh, God. She had kids. Go, go, bro. Go, bro. <laughs> go. Kids, bro. bro, are you okay? Well, said, you know. Tough, you know, it was pretty tough, but leave. Fellas, fellas, especially the fellas, this could be a clue in the women, too. But, fellas, and like, please, if you talking to somebody, please make sure that if you they don't have kids because trying to date somebody with kids is too much, mm -hmm. it's too much. Because you don't know what that other parent is doing and their foot is always going to be at in the door in that relationship because they got kids with that person. And you don't know how that other person is. He could be a control freak. He could be mm -hmm. this and this and that. Like, y'all, if y'all know, if you see people with kids and you try to date somebody that has a kid, please don't do it. Mm -hmm. Because I feel like that's too much. That's, that's, that's a problem that you do not want. 
mm-hmm. and that's gonna be a headache that you could avoid. Mm-hmm. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's a headache that you got. Please avoid. Please mm-hmm. avoid that at all costs. You crumble sometimes. Yeah. You, you, get, you get some L sometimes, bro. But, but all right, all right. Well, that was my story. Well, what's yours? Well, I'm glad you asked, Weed, because tonight I have a plethora of stories from some of my favorite scary n****. Should I say scary menaces? But before we get mm-hmm. into the video, a word from today's sponsor, Honkai Impact 3rd. Today's sponsor for oh. the video mm. is Honkai Impact the Third. And today I want to talk about a new version that dropped on October 27th. They got brand new characters. W sponsor, man. Mm-hmm. Yo, shout out to Sensei. He got a sponsor, man. My mm-hmm. waifu lovers are going to be into those outfits because I'm into them. If you've been living <laughs> under a rock and you don't know, Honkai Impact the Third tells a story of Valkyries fighting against an energy called Honkai that erodes the world as they protect humanity. The main character of version 6.1 is a sword woman with an ancient Chinese style just like Zong Li from Genshin hmm. Impact. I'm gonna talk about Li Shu Zhang. I tried one again. It is. Born in Shenzo 500 years ago, and when she was 15, she was instructed by her master to head out on her own and take on the trials. She then met Otto, but within the time of getting to know Otto, she becomes seriously injured. So Otto used his six cell technology to cryogenically freeze her before waking her up at Kalistan. Li Shu Zhang hmm. stands firmly on her sword while using her agility to warp through the wow. sword array. She is. All right, I know that's a sponsor, bro, but. We gotta get to the thing. Mm-hmm. Sorry, bro, boy. I love your sponsor, man, but I'm gonna talk about a lot of different n- tonight, bro. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, I mean a ton, bro. The other night I was on stream, I was watching a bunch of n- on YouTube, yeah. clips after clips after clips, and I've compiled some of the most menacing moments that I could come up with. Oh, Frank right, versus so Jason. Yeah. <laughs> face, bro. Now, some of y'all may or may not know him from Texas Chainsaw Massacre, bro. And there's a new movie that came out. I ain't gonna lie, bro. I gotta go watch this shit because this clip was crazy. So he's in this bus getting transported. It's him, another in the back watching him, and two guys. In the <laughs> front, <bro. And> I- <laughs> yeah, we did watch the new one. Yeah, I think Jacob Lattimore was in it. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, that one was crazy. <laughs> what? From point A to point B, bro. But I was wrong, bro. This grabbed the dude's arm in the back seat, bro, and broke his goddamn wrist. Yeah. This this whole arm bone came out, bro. And then he used his arm bone to stab his neck in the neck. Now after this happens, bro, they stop the whole van, bro. This hop out, go to the passenger side seat, hit this neck in the face with a fucking log. Bro, that shit don't make any goddamn sense. This a lumberjack or something in his spare time? But that didn't even matter, bro. Cause after this transport scene, bro, there's a whole bus scene where this nigga slaughtered. And it's this part was so stupid. Like he was in a slaughterhouse, bro. That part was so stupid to me. I'm like, y'all really about to record him and he got a whole chainsaw? Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, man. It's like when you're in a horror movie, you like I say, when you're in a horror movie, you make dumb decisions. But the fact that you, the fact that like, the fact that you took your phone out and tried to record, man. Yeah. I feel like y'all. I feel like this will really happen in real life. Yeah, people will really take their phones out and record somebody like that, and not think twice about running. Yeah. Hmm. This shit is crazy. The censoring in this video is going to be insane. We're going to have to blur a whole lot of shit. Because I can't even believe that they smoked these many n****s. This n- <laughs> cut the bitch in half when she was trying to leave the bus, bro. This bitch mm. got half her body out the damn window. That was he stupid. Got body out the damn window. He was treating this bitch like a magic trick. Like he was going to saw her. <laughs> yeah. There's even this one part in the clip in a different scene. But this picked up an entire old lady with the chainsaw. Had her on that bitch like a <laughs> shish kebab. <laughs> it's, it's a menace. But I want to move on past this nigga Leatherface for a second, mm. bro. And I want to talk about this nigga Candyman, bro. <laughs> oh, Candyman. <laughs> oh, he was right scary. Mm-hmm. Beating up cops. Bro, at the end of this new Candyman movie, this nigga was smoking police officers, bro. A police officer ran out. They looking at him. Yo, he got blood all on him and shit. <laughs> yeah. This nigga confused as to what could have possibly done this. Oh, I can't wait this until the next one. On mm-hmm. on. And then he arose, nigga. Captain Hook, bro. This nigga came out with a goddamn hook. <laughs> he was slaughtering <laughs> every man, bro, man every cop. Got a whole colony of bees on you. That must be real cool with the queen bee, bro. I'm just saying. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I ain't so little Kim, though. Put that shit in him. The other nigga ran instantly. They bro, stupid. Let me, let me in the car. Bro, there ain't no way you're getting in this car. You're getting your whole goddamn throat slit. But after yeah. he- okay, we seen this, y'all. I, I'm not going to lie. She got me so mad because when Homeboy was going like going through a trance and becoming Candyman, mm. she literally, that was her boyfriend. She literally left him in the apartment. 
and let him suffer by himself. And you went to your brother's house just to go and smoke weed to get your stuff and leave him hanging. I'm like, that's your boyfriend. Go check, on, see if he's yeah. okay. Like you bugging. Like mm. it was the last cop. The cop in the goddamn driver's seat of the car that was locked the entire time decides, oh, let me leave the safety of my car to run away. And this nigga starts running and then gets caught by Vespa Queen in the goddamn alleyway, mm. bro. Oh my god. <laughs> he on X Games mode. Bro was floating with bees around him. You know what? There's a goddamn minute when he's possessed by fing bees, bro. He got mm. bees just buzzing around him and shit. You know, I don't uh -oh. know giving bees a bad name, y'all. Cause all these niggas try to do is pollinate flowers and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, I I'm just saying. But they tried to shoot this nigga with 48 clips, bro. I'm not nah, gonna this nigga is a mortal, bro. That shit didn't do anything. Dude, that guy was taking bullets, bro. man. Like it was nothing. Real quick, cause you know I gotta have my little Chucky in this joint. Now at mm. the end of this goddamn movie, they got Andy and this mother mental asylum. That looks so like stupid. Crazy, so got him in a padded room, but Andy played the long con and had a the TV series. I am not watching that. Chucky, cause he knew that Chucky was like, no. Him. So Chucky get a key card and go in this goddamn padded room, bro. This yeah, Andy got it. This Chucky pulled the strap out. He grabbed the strap, bro. He pulled the strap out. What is this? Bro, he had it in his stomach. Bro, he yeah. Got damn gun out and put forty-eight holes in this, bro. He. Like, <laughs> 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 yeah. So many bullets off, yo. That when a shorty popped up, tried to f with him. He tried to shoot her and there was no bullets left. Put one right in his, his head, bro. That that wasn't even the worst part. First off, this Chucky had organs, bro. Why the mm. f does this doll have internal organs? He started stomping on his. <laughs> 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 Oh, yeah. Oh, my. The funniest scenes I've ever seen in my goddamn life. Oh, resurrection. I'm not going to lie. That joint was. It was. It was. Man, for a horror movie, that scene was hilarious. Yo, know? he was having a kung fu fight with Buster. What? The fact this guy hit Michael Myers with a roundhouse kick. Yo, yo, he was like, "You fucking!" Like, I'm looking like, no. And yo, he kicked him out the window and made him hung himself. Yo. <laughs> I'm like, oh my, oh my god, god. is y'all serious? Yo, <laughs> yo dude, <laughs> yo, he really roundhouse kicked him. Was that see? I'm like, what the hell? <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna lie, that you know, I'm not gonna lie, yo, it was both. It was both funny and shit. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Yo, I'm in tears over here, bro. <laughs> you roundhouse kicked my. <laughs> he just stood there and ate the joint though too. I felt like that movie. Well, at least that one was better than um, uh, Halloween um ends. Mm. Halloween ends sucked. I'm just gonna be honest with you. Halloween ends sucked. They could have kept it. I heard the way my voice just cracked. I said, "Post the rhymes." Like what the. But bro, you know this nigga Michael Myers is a goddamn menace, bro. When he's having a whole entire kung fu fight with fing Buster Rhymes, bro. Stop. Yeah, <laughs> he he caught him though. That's the part that was funny. No. I can't believe that actually worked. And early in the movie, he was watching kung fu movies too. <laughs> no, the funny is that tilt your hat to the side. Remember, he was like this, like, you ain't playing Michael Myers. I'm playing Michael Myers. He, huh? You don't get that? You don't get that? Yeah. Yo, I was like, yo, you bugging, bro. So and then he, like and then he died. Damn near got that girl killed in the shed. Mm -hmm. I was tight. Start making kung fu noises. Bro thought he was it man or something. I was just saying. Michael would hit this with the meanest spin kick. Yo. <laughs> Mike was not expecting that. Bro, you know this nigga Buster Rhymes is going crazy, bro. So then this nigga Michael choking it. He like, <laughs> so we hit this nigga boom, and then kicked him with a. See? <laughs> out the window, bro. Had this nigga Michael hanging from the window. He was twitching. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Crazy, but it's Halloween. Fuck it. So they on this goddamn reality TV show and they message this 
Yo, that Michael was not dead, bro. And I was like, mm. oh, no. So later on in the movie, bro, Michael comes back again, bro. But Buster Rhymes kicks the door down. Bro. <laughs> Get to the light, bitch. Hit this nigga with an axe, Mickey. Then this nigga, Michael, I mean. He when he threw him to that wall. Hit that shelf. Oh, <laughs> Yo, that was funny. Yo, that whole shelf disintegrated. <laughs> so he ended up grabbing these goddamn wires and electrocuting Michael in the goddamn nuts. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I'm not going to lie. Michael Myers went back like, woo. <laughs> he felt that. <laughs> Yo, but this next scene is also very funny, bro. Because this is from Michael Myers, bro, in Halloween Kills. And I'm not gonna lie, yo, this shit was insane. Because they jumped the shit out of this. Oh, they did jump them, though, bro. Mm. Literally, fight that. Fight that. <laughs> 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 Man, they just mugged him. <laughs> <laughs> they they did mug them. No, the part that got me tight was it was like, why would y'all stop? Man, y'all was beating them with bats, two by fours, woods, man, shooting them in the chest. And this nigga put the fucking mask on, bro. And they start jumping this guy. I am not gonna lie, they rocking his ass, hit him with all types of shit. They had a two by four like he just came from Home Depot. Yeah, yeah, hacksaw. He hacksaw Jim Duggan. She unloaded the whole gun. She unloaded the whole cowboy gun in this Yo, let the whole clip off in this nigga. Mm. Really rocking his ass. One was like, Mickey, Mickey, weave, weave, blue, blue, bro. What's a shorty in the background watching this, bro? My, uh, 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 what shorty name, yo? I Karen, know, yo, the I main think. character. It was her daughter, bro. I don't know that bitch name. For, you feel me? Blonde girl number three. You feel me? I'm just saying. She gets turned on while watching this. She like, yeah, yeah. So my. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, son, the movies was the funniest and classics. Michael gonna mm. grab this knife, bro. She walk up and grab it first, and then stab this nigga, and then started repeatedly stabbing him. Like she was getting an orgasm from this shit. This got a Christmas sweater mm. on on Halloween. <laughs> right. Mm. Yo, she is the crazy one. So as this is happening, bro, the main character of the story is explaining that brute force does not work on this nigga, bro. And right then, yo, this nigga caught the goddamn knife and stood up, and it was. <laughs> Over. <laughs> I mean, this nigga was getting a kill streak. Editor, I'm hope you're keeping up with this goddamn kill count, bro, because he was going insane in the scene. I mean, this nigga at least Yo, he was. Man, he, he caught his second win and man, went a killing, man, a bloodbath. He was fucking shit up. Bro, stabbed the fat cop first. Sheriff Bracket. No bullets left. Kill him, bro. The funniest part was, who was the dude that was rallying up the troops? What was his name? Tommy, <laughs> Tommy, bro, when he called me, he was shaking like, oh, yeah. no, what did he do? Why did he zoomed in on his face like that? <laughs> fought an entire mob, bro. Like he was goddamn Jariah versus Payne, but this time Jariah did not die, bro. This nigga was beating the shit out of him. Yo, Adam, play him beating the fuck out of everybody, but play that sad ass Naruto music. It's like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> it don't make it no better. Talked about an icon, a legend, bro. I want to talk about a little, you know, lesser known guy, bro. I want to talk about my nigga Leprechaun, bro. Cause oh, yeah, yeah. Leprechaun. Leprechaun back in the hood, bro. Oh, I loved it, this movie. Yeah, that one was so good. One scene, bro, where this nigga was boxing the Leprechaun. I mean, he hit this nigga with the show. Oh, you get <laughs> it. <laughs> <laughs> That shit did not matter, bro. He rocked this nigga over and over and over again, bro. And this leprechaun nigga just kept getting back up. Like, he had the durability of Tsunade, bro. This nigga was going hmm. crazy. He had self-heal or something. <laughs> yeah. So, bro is tired as shit from boxing. Mommy, he's out of breath with it. He... And this nigga leprechaun walk up to him and hit this nigga with a goddamn death grip. I mean, he had this nigga heart in his hand, bro. Yo, yo. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So they started shooting them. First off, where the f did they get these black ops two guns from? These <laughs> pull these guns out of nowhere, bro. They didn't have guns in the last scene. They mm. got them AK 47s, AN 94s. They said the MSMC, bro. This was going crazy. I'm loaded 40,000 clips in this. 
None of that mm. shit work, bro. They lit his ass yeah. up. Just for him to get up and start punishing niggas, bro. He slices one nigga. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Walked up to him. Sticky he fingers. Up, <laughs> up, <laughs> slam. Mm. Bam. Bro, how you get slammed by a midget? I'm just saying, bro. Ain't no goddamn way you got slammed like that, man. I'm just saying. And yeah, he was in stomp the yard. Niggas got punished mm. over some fucking gold, bro. Gold that they probably wouldn't even be able to do nothing with. Slayer was punishing y'all. Y'all punished by a leprechaun. Bro. Man, y'all got beat up day? by a <laughs> leprechaun, though. <laughs> Remember when he was on the phone with that one chick that was supposed to be calling homeboy in the um the jumpsuit mm -hmm. that killed that he took his heart? She was like, "Oh, how tall are you?" Like she he was flirting with her. About three foot six. She was like three foot six. <laughs> she <laughs> hung up on him. <laughs> Talk about a scene from scary movie. I know y'all with the scary movie joints, bro. Mm -hmm. But yo, I ain't gonna lie. Cindy in the kitchen, you feel me? Yo, Scream will get jumped. This is one of the yeah, trust me, we will jump so him. Black Shorty in there watching the goddamn ring, bro. Shorty get the moving and coming off the TV, bro. The TV star leaking, bro. She goes, Cindy, the TV's leaking. Yo, she is yeah. hilarious. She crawled out the TV, bro. She still eating popcorn, watching this shit like this a goddamn movie premiere. But I am not. Yeah. Bad. She said, uh oh, Cindy, this bitch messing up my floor. Doctor, Mickey. Bro, I'm not gonna hold you, bro. She said, get up, you little ugly bitch. Hit her with the wind up, uppercut, bro. Yo, she was dumb. Bro, she said, I'm whipping her ass, Cindy. Bro, I ain't gonna lie. She rocked her ass back, though. Boom. I ain't gonna hold you, bro. They get the box into this shit. Mickey, Mickey, chin it up, hitting her so hard. Yo, this bitch died, bro. But I had to. Why the fuck this ugly ass bitch when the ring come out? Yo, but I am not gonna hold you, bro. I talked about a lot of this, bro. But I gotta talk about this weird ass Pennywise. Oh, it, man, no, 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 it, it, homie's a weirdo, bro. <laughs> yeah. In the sewer. <laughs> this pedophile ass <laughs> this whole thing, bro. It doesn't matter, bro. But this nigga decided that he wanted to feast on the fear of children. First off, nigga, pause on the play, bro. Get this nigga out of here, FBI. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. <laughs> <laughs> bro, get this nigga out of here, bro. There ain't no goddamn mm. way you got Pennywise doing this shit. And then he decided to dress up like a goddamn clown, bro. And then he talk about that scary ass shit. Your wall flow too. Your wall flow too. Your wall flow too. Bro, get the <laughs> fuck out of here. Oh my god. Shit. Bro got a whole underground lair where he just brings children and feast on them, bro. And he did all of that weird ass Mr. Rogers shit. Just <laughs> yeah. about the same kids. Once they realized this nigga was feasting off of their fears, bro, they started punishing this nigga. Literally. Mm. Get the fuck out of this clown. Yo, they beat. Yo, they bro, just they jumped him, man. Thank you. Thank you. Yo, yo, yeah, I'm not going. Yo, up. when he did this dance, this joint got in so viral, bro. <laughs> yo, this is the most funny. <laughs> <laughs> do your do your chain low do it while I was on the that I have in mind, bro. But we gotta get your f a light bulb head looking at a bright idea head looking at. <laughs> I'm really on you. Come here. A pet head looking at. Yo, what's up with it, man? Yeah. Uh, uh, <laughs> elbow head looking at. If you could talk. I'm just saying. Yo. And then you see touching on kids, but uh, hold on, zoom in on them King of Hearts shoes. Yeah. Yeah. You got two tumors in your feet because you talk about that. All right, all right, my fault. Yeah. Ass, bro, mm. bro, bro, hold on, hold on, hold on. Pause on the scene. Pause on a goddamn play. Before we get to that, bro, I almost left out one of the goddamn iconic menaces, bro. I almost left out my ghost face, bro. I can't disrespect ghost face like that. Scream. Ghost face got so many goddamn kills, bro. First off, how's this uh, human every time I got superhuman abilities, bro? He be throwing this off buildings and shit. <laughs> yeah. He threw one bitch off a balcony, bro. Broke her leg and shit. This one mm. bitch was crawling away from him, yo. He closed the garage door, broke her back. This one nigga was walking. Mm. Yo, <laughs> can you imagine? Yo, can you imagine you on campus and you just walk in there? He just snatched you up and put you in a van. Yeah. <laughs> Man, you gotta watch your back every time. Oh, yeah. that was that movie. Jason in the dream world and use his fears against him. And turn into his mom to start fucking with him, bro. Start <laughs> using his mom to talk shit, bro. You know I was gonna tell you what they normally say, but you know I gotta hit you with a hood translation. Then turn to his mom. He was like, <clears throat> Yo, gang, gang. 
man. Get your first off, son. Cause you talking about really on you. You a fucking failure. Nigga. How you at a campsite with all these hoes and you don't got no hoes? Where your hoes at? Hold on, <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, no hoes having that. Uh, come on, bro. Camp Crystal Lake. <laughs> You had a camp with all these bitches. All right, my fault, my fault. And then you get mad at them, so you start killing campers and shit. How you gonna kill somebody? You get mad, you get bullied, bro. And you scared of water. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you scared of H two O? He said you scared of water. You scared of liquids, bro? Man, H two O. Bro out here scared of goddamn H two O, bro. Scared of chemicals, soft ass nick. But you can kill this with a big ass machete, but you don't want to take a bat. All right, my fault. Yeah, I'm my not fault, gonna lie. Bro. Hey, yo, Jason, man. Show, you know what I'm saying? Like, ask my son and shit. You're like, ah, I f with you. But I really don't f with you for real. Cause you <laughs> See, Jason, like, I'm scared of Jason. I just, you gotta just avoid, like, him catching you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, this. Can this, you imagine Leatherface? Y'all, can y'all imagine Leatherface? You're in the woods. You know how fast he runs. Can y'all imagine y'all in the woods at night mm -hmm. and he's chasing you through the woods with the chainsaw yeah. and you cannot stop or make one mistake? Because if you make one mistake, you're dead. Yo, I'm not going to lie. That, man, how fat, how big that dude is, how fast he grew Can up. Can you imagine running through the woods and he got a chainsaw? Shoot, man. Oh, my God. You better pray that you not fall. I, and the thing about Jason is, I don't know if this guy could... He could teleport, man, dude. He be teleporting. <laughs> he be teleporting. Dude, the guy be... This guy's strong enough to go through windows, walls, doors. Man. Yeah, even the top of a roof couldn't even stop this, man. <laughs> yeah. Yo. Yeah. <laughs> you could have been a dentist. You know what I'm saying? Put your ass with kill kids and shit. So at this point, bro, this can hop up, bro, and get both his arms cut off. He's like, oh, no. My arms. <laughs> And he regenerates his arms like this nigga Piccolo. <laughs> <laughs> eating the shit out of this nigga, bro. Dude, this nigga he was shit. catching Jason Loki a little bit. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, he was tagging him though. Telepathy on this bro. Pin him against the wall. Started pinballing him all over. Yeah. Nigga was going for a high score. Bro dropped an entire boiler on this nigga, bro. He's like, why don't you die? And then this nigga Jason started fighting. <laughs> Yo, Jason was started fucking this nigga up a little bit. Make it, make it, boom, boom. But then this nigga used water, bro. He was a scared of that shit. But then he turned this nigga back into. Mm. Yo, these movies are crazy, bro. So yeah. our childhood, literally. Mm -hmm. I know there were some movies that came out before we was born, but we literally watched these all the time growing up. Yeah, these, man, these was literally like, man, these was literally like our childhood, though, like. Like, y'all, you don't understand, me and Leaky Lee, we been watch so much horror movies and anime stuff, mm -hmm. it's like, trust me, y'all, like, that's what inspired us to start this channel. Yo, I'm not gonna lie, we had a dope childhood, I'm not gonna lie. I know there was probably childhood. some, like, downfalls in our life that, you know, that was kind of keeping us sad, but if it wasn't for horror and anime, yo, trust me, y'all, we wouldn't even be here making this channel, y'all, because mm -hmm. this inspired us right here to really just make a channel, because yeah. we love it so much. You see it in our background, mm -hmm. we love it so much, y'all, oh my goodness. He was scared to death, bro, this nigga was ugly as shit, bro, this was in a fetal position crying like a bitch, bro. So <laughs> yo, yo Freddie gets out of the yo, Freddie was fight right, yo, he was scared. I ain't gonna lie, this nigga Freddie was fast as shit, he was dodging, he was like, weave, weave. Weave, weave, weave. But then this guy grabbed and threw into a <laughs> window, bro. This he was Oh, my. Yo, he destroyed him. Oh. Uh, throwing this <laughs> into a goddamn house. <laughs> <laughs> Mickey, Mickey, Mickey. But then this guy started kneeing him and shit. Their fight was <laughs> foul. <laughs> Yo, I'm not going to When Jason swung that machine, you can see the wind behind it. <laughs> <laughs> Man. Then he smacked him with another oh. one. Where do you get all this stuff from? He tried to drop this crate on him too, bro. Like he was a goddamn Bugs Bunny or Looney Tune, nigga. Got <laughs> on the boiler, <laughs> fell down, bro. So this nigga Jason grab him. Crate fall on both of them. Boom, boom. Then this nigga cut bro fingers off. Bro. Oh, yeah. He was Started slicing, bro. Mickey, Mickey, Mickey. But then he stabbed this nigga eyes. Oh. When he did that, I was like, yo. Yeah, that was one of the most savage things I ever seen. Yo, he did. Oh. So Jason rocked this new 
through his stomach, bro. Boom! Punch his <laughs> arm. His arm. His arm. Cut his arm off. Man. Freddy stab him back. Man. And you know it's got to be a goddamn Tarantino movie or something, bro. It was at least one explosion happening. Because as they f***ing each other up, there's this big-ass explosion in the back. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so exploded, he came out of the water to attack the two little niggas that was there. And then this nigga, Jason, walked up and saved the day. Stabbed this nigga with his own glove, bro. You died to your own weapon. I can't mm. even believe that shit happened to you, nigga. He got burnt in the first movie, bro, for being a pedophile. Then he got killed by your own weapon. <laughs> yeah. You know I'm, saying? I'm not gonna lie, bro. Those were some crazy ass stories, bro. Like, <laughs> yeah. Wait, said, did you hear that? Wait, I hear what? Oh my god, hold on. Wait. <laughs> Is the light flickering on and on? Bro, do we stop playing, bro? You playing with the fucking light switch, bro? Yo, said, I swear to God, it's not me, bro. Oh my god. Said, mm. said I'm scared. It's <laughs> yeah. Said, Wait a minute, do we? What? Hey, did you pay the electric bill? Oh. Yo, yeah. shout out to Sensei, yeah, man. That was, this man. is a good video. It brought back so much nostalgia, too, also. Y'all, we was really band watching this stuff growing up. I wish he could have mentioned Jeeper Creepers. There was so much stuff he didn't even mention. Like man. Killer Clowns. The it was, Shining. It was Cujo. Mm -hmm. Oh, my goodness, yo. Like, there's so many joints that he did not mention. Mm -hmm. But I'm like, yo... That was our childhood, man. I'm yeah. so glad he made a video about this because you got to acknowledge these people. Mm -hmm. He got to make a part two with, yeah. with more people, with different people and stuff. I hope he can, mm -hmm. but I, I hope he does if he ever thinks about it. But yeah, y'all, that's the video for today, y'all. That yo, was good, though. Yo, for real, man, mm -hmm. I enjoyed this one. Shout out to um, Sensei, man. Mm -hmm. Yo, he's the GOAT, man. Go subscribe to Sensei, y'all. Mm -hmm. um, please like, comment, and subscribe, and join our big happy mm -hmm. family, y'all. We love making um, stuff for y'all so y'all can have a better yep. day and stuff. We love y'all so much, y'all. Please subscribe to us, man. See y'all next time. See you next, next time. Next reaction. Deuces!